Hey, hello everyone. Hello, hello. Hi everyone, Esther here. Good to see you all. It's Monday evening over here. Uh, time for another live. Hi, good to see you. I'm trying to find um, you <laughs> and myself <laughs> on the internet so we can have a chat. Let me see. Okay, I think I found you. Yes, we're here. And I am not sure if anyone is watching already. Yes! Hi, Ruth. Welcome, welcome. Hi, good to see you. Hi, Patricia, welcome. Hi, hi. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Good to see you. Hi, Anne. Hi, Katrina. <laughs> Uh, I'm watching two screens, so if you see me moving my head <laughs> up and down, <laughs> it's because of the two screens. I'm seeing you in front of me and on my iPad, uh, a little bit on the bottom over here. Hi Cory, hi Maja, hi Anita, hi. How are you all doing? Good to see you. Okay, I, hi Annemiek, <laughs> hello. Hi Suzanne. Okay, I hope... Um, this all um, keeps working like it should be. Uh, as you know, I'm not that technical technical uh, with all those things. So um, hopefully it will stay okay. Is the sound okay? Because last couple of times I was doing a live and then... Um, <laughs> you were... <laughs> yes, I love the tickets too. Thanks, Debbie. Now people were starting to complain about the sound, that it wasn't okay. So. I had to do some um, something with the screwdriver. David advised me, so I hopefully uh, I hope it's okay now. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Katrina. So, uh, hi, Annette. Good to see you too. Hi, Michelle. Hi, everyone. Okay, uh, my plan for today is um, I'm going to try to make something a little bit interactive um, with a pocket, and it's something I've seen a long time ago somewhere on the internet and. It's not my own idea, so uh, all the credits go to, I don't know who, and I don't remember where I saw it. Um, but it was fun, and I remembered it, and I was thinking, okay, I'm going to do this today. Um, what I need, and what I prepared, okay, I'm going to take this out of my journal, to make it a little bit more easy to work with. <laughs> Hi Femke, Rhonda, Olivia, the sound is good, okay. <laughs> Uh, thank you all. I'm going to move this one behind. Oh, I have to change the camera. Sorry, guys. <laughs> so this will be a little bit better. Then you can see what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to put this one aside. Okay. Here's the plan. Uh, a a, a full-size planner page. And here is one of the pages. Well, it's a half page with a tab on the side. It's from the Christmas release. Uh, was it last year? Yes, it was last year. So I took this page, half page with the tab, and I die cut it. And that's this one. And this is a regular full size page. So my plan is um, to make something uh, which I'm going to attach here in the corner, and then it moves out in and out of this pocket. So this is going to pocket. And before I forget, sorry, there's a little note in front of me saying the winner of the $50 gift certificate. And her name is, yes, it's a her, it's a she, it's Annette Watts Gardner. So, uh, Annette, please contact eCraftDesigns, info at the eCraftDesigns.com uh, to claim your gift certificate. So, congratulations to you, Annette. Okay. Else is in a different time zone. Is Else also here? I think she's on a holiday, but um, she always wants to watch. <laughs> Hi, Sandra. Good to see you too. Oh, the sound is okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, what I already did. I prepared some pictures. I printed them. Um, the page is here, which I am going to attach in a minute. And there are some cards I'm going to use. And I do need a lot today, I hope. And I think everything is here, but probably I've been forgotten something too. But okay, uh, I will fix that later if I miss something. Um, the first plan is, because um, 
Yeah, I think the best thing to start with, I didn't make this one before. So if I fail, you are all going to witness me, okay? <laughs> it's just an idea I had this afternoon and I remembered it from some time ago and hopefully it works. Okay, I need some blue. I'm going to use a double-sided adhesive. Ah, she was on the beach five minutes ago. <laughs> hey, Dana, good to see you too. Okay, I'm trying to find the beginning of this roll of <laughs> double-sided tape. Yes, got it. And I'm going to apply some tape um, only on the side of the... Uh, let me see. It's, I want it to be this way, so I'm going to glue this down. Uh, what I think now is that the bottom part should, should stay open, so I'm only going to apply a little bit of tape also at the top side. And yes, there's, I, I'm a little bit earlier, so for the people in Holland, <laughs> uh, you probably uh, are going to, you probably will be too late, or if you have noticed, um, and you had you are in time, but um, you can join me. But otherwise, you can watch watch it later. Okay, did I do this? Okay, yes. Okay, so um, I glued down this part and the top part. This one stays open. So my idea is to uh, attach some pictures on some mats, put them in here, and then something like this will go out. So I'm not sure if it's going to work, but I'm going to give it a try. I have those really cute pictures of the little girls, of our granddaughters, and I printed it two times the same pictures, because uh, my idea is um, to make a long strip with all the pictures uh, on top of each other, and if I am putting it in like this, you won't see everything, so I think I'm going to um, cut them both and then glue them on top of a card. So what I took for these um, as cardstock? I found a tag which was still laying around, so I think I'm going to use this one too. And these are some uh, vintage uh, index cards, which I still had laying around, and I'm going to use those too. I need my paper trimmer, and I am going to try to see the comments. Oh, Els, you're here. <laughs> Els, you don't need to watch. Go and enjoy your holiday. Hey, David. <laughs> Imperfections. Oh, yay. I missed something already. I'm not sure. Yes, Cindy, I'm a little bit early. It's because of the time difference in um, in the US, Cindy. That is all uh, summertime. Summertime already started over there. So that's why we had to change. Okay. I am, this one doesn't fit, so I will trim this down with a pair of scissors and I hope this one will fit into the pocket I'm going to make because I'm not sure if it's going to work because um, I want to attach it here in the corner and now I need to try if this yeah it, it, uh, I don't want it to interfere with the rings, you know, so that's why I'm trying it first, because if it's moving like this, well, I think I'm good when I do this. Okay, hopefully it stays the same. Um, pictures, pictures. Let me see. This one will go, so I'm going to trim this down too. And I would like to stay... Um, I would like to keep the white border around the pictures, so that's why I am trimming it. Oh, <laughs> I'm a little bit off. <laughs> and let me see. Okay, this one goes better now. Okay, and I am going to trim the other one down too, if I can find it. <laughs> okay, and what we were doing here, by the way, we were baking pancakes, so our two uh, granddaughters were uh, with us and they wanted to have pancakes for dinner, so that's what we did. 
and I am going to cut these two. Yes, I'm going to put a, a, a grommet, uh, bread, something like that, <laughs> so it can rip off. <laughs> Or turn turn around a little bit. Storm snowstorm. Help me to bring a huge snowstorm. Oh my. Hi Marian, welcome, welcome. Je kan altijd terugkijken hoor, dus als je iets later bent, geen probleem. Okay, just put down <coughs> the pictures a little bit. I might just as well do this one also. Yes, I'm um, there because of the um, some part that is in uh, in the US. So that's why we are uh, one hour earlier than usual in Europe. And I think it changes again in two weeks because that's when we are starting our summertime, if I'm correct, two or three weeks, not completely sure. Okay, let me see. I want this one to go in there. This is going to be a little bit too much, probably. Let me see, one of those. Hmm. This one has a rounded corner on that side and it's missing on this side because I trimmed it down a little bit. So I am going to, uh, probably you won't see this one, but oh, two weeks, yes. Welcome, everyone. <laughs> Just in case I miss you joining us, joining me. Okay, I'm going to keep this quite simple. That's what I'm thinking now, but this is really a little bit, um, yeah, how shall I say, dull, a bit boring. It needs a little bit more color, so I am going to see if I can find something um, in my planner. No, I don't want blue. <laughs> Let me see what, um, it's going to be blue <laughs> probably because there's a lot of blue papers left. Um, or dark blue, not sure. Let me see. I don't really care too much about colors matching together, but, uh, if it's possible, I want it to be a little bit, this is all pink. Ah, red. It's going to be here, so I should add a little bit of red. Red, 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 red. Oi, oi, oi. That's going to be difficult for now, I think. Let me take a quick look. A <laughs> stash. There should be something with a little bit red. Ah, here. Oh, the black. Black is always good. Is it good? No. You won't see this. No, I need something which is solid. Solid, 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 orange, yellow. Ah, uh, let me see, here. It's not bright red, but it is a little bit reddish. I'm not sure if this is a correct word, reddish, but okay. For me, it is reddish today. Um, Lily, let me see, what are you asking? Something about the pictures. Oh, do you have a Canon selfie, the, the, the little one? Um, maybe you should uh, change something in your settings. There's this option which you can change it, the colors, and you have to make sure it's on Vivid. That's the only thing I know. And otherwise you can maybe uh, edit them on your cell phone before you print them. Yeah, the small photos. Um, I was thinking this afternoon, I'm going to put a whole border of those small pictures on the side. But then I'm, um, some, somehow this idea came up and I changed it. So, okay, some tape. My plan, my, it's still on my to-do list, is making um, some short videos about how to print uh, pictures to the sizes to the sizes of most of our dies. And I know I promised this 
some time ago already, but you know, life happens and then suddenly you are half a year further and you still didn't do it. So, so please forgive me, but it's still on my to-do list, guys. Okay, you see, this looks much better. I'm going to move the blue one to the side. And then, should I trim it by hand or with the paper trimmer? To be on the safe side, I'm going to take the larger one. Printing can. Oh yeah, there are so many possibilities um, with printing your photo. So many different apps. So it's so hard to cover these options all. Um, wait, let me see. Okay, I think I'm going to leave a little bit of the red paper underneath. Uh, it's not really necessary because you probably won't see it. What I'm thinking, that's what I'm thinking now, but okay. This is a little bit, um, I need marble. Just a little bit ink on the edges. And again, this is what am I using? As usual, freight burlap. <laughs> oh, Pat, yes, I will do my best. Uh, hopefully within a couple of weeks, because uh, at the moment we are very busy uh, moving my parents-in-law to another home. Um, they need to be taken care of a little bit more, so they are going to move within three weeks. And for now we have to do a lot of painting. Um, wallpapering the complete apartment so but, <laughs> but after that my plan is um to do some videos about um, printing pictures but then i can only show it to you on my iphone so if you have another device um, i'm not sure if this is really helpful but a lot of those things uh, work similar i think Okay, so this is my first one, which is going to be in here. Not sure how, but <laughs> we will figure it out later. And I can add one of those here. Oh, maybe it's also fun to um, ferry, 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 yes. <laughs> in size a little. So I am going to trim this one down too. And maybe I can do two inside. Let me see if this one goes here. Yes. I'm making it a little bit shorter. And that one will go in here. That's my plan. Oh, guys, I hope I succeed in doing this because <laughs> otherwise it will be a big failure. But okay. And if I do this. Yeah, it should be okay, don't you think? Should I layer this one too? I don't think so. I'm going to distress the edges a little bit more. This one. And maybe I should do the other one too. I forgot. <laughs> I shoot this one too. And I don't need to do the, bot the bottom part because you don't see that. So I'm only going to do the sides. Oh, see you later, Tracy. Hope you're doing fine. Oh, Belinda, that's really nice. Thank you. <laughs> yes, it's a challenge. That's correct. <laughs> Oh, I should take one um, paper punch thingy. Yes. Okay, and now I am looking for a pair of tweezers. <laughs> And it may be, hi Teresa, oh, see you later. You can always watch it back. 
uh, a reinforcement. And I'm going for a black one. Here we go. I like to add another um, reinforcer on top of those tags because it's giving a, a little bit more dimension because of the layering. You know, it has a, a reinforcer already printed on here. And I'm just adding an extra one. You don't need to do that, but I think it's fun. <laughs> okay, so this one is going to be here. Or should I put in some red too? Decisions, decisions. Oh boy. I think I will do two pictures. When I put in three, um, three pieces of paper, I think I can do it, but it's going to be a little bit tight probably. So mm, I think I'm leaving it with two and I'm going to use um, this picture on the other page or somewhere else. Not sure yet. Or should I put in this one here? Hmm. Toot, toot. Okay. Why is it so hard to choose sometimes? Okay, I'm going to put this one in here. And I don't see... Oh, the audio is low again. Hi, Terry. Good to see you. Maybe I'm just talking a little bit uh, silently. Silently? No. How do you say it? I should talk louder, maybe. <laughs> Terry, can you hear me? Yes, I think you can. <laughs> okay. This one goes here. And also what I need to do is um, add something on the side so you can easily take the, um, the pieces of paper out. So that's what I'm going to do first. Let me see. It might be fun to add a card with journaling. Can I do that? Yes, I can. Um, let me think if I am going to... Put it on the sides. No, <laughs> it's too big. I think it's too large. Hmm. I think when I trim this off, this part, maybe. I'm just thinking out loud, guys. <laughs> so this one is here and it should go like that. But then the journaling is upside down. So when I'm going to add it like this, it's going to be there. It needs to be here. And then when you slide it out is this correct no it's not possible is it let me see this one yes okay i'm going to mark it over here in this corner that i need to punch a hole here then i can do some journaling i will do that later but then when you take these three out you can also see this uh, am i thinking correctly yes i think i am okay so I'm going to put in three. Um, not sure how I am going to do that yet. Because this corner has a little bit rounded edge and this one doesn't and this one also doesn't. So I think I'm going to make uh, a little bit rounded corner over there and over there because that's approximately the same uh, corner as you have on this page. So that's a little bit neater, I think. Neater, no. Neater is something else. Uh, netjes, okay. <laughs> What's on the pictures? Um, on these pictures, Marie Claire? We are baking pancakes. Full tabs, yes, I already know. I know, I know, I know. Full tabs. But I have been thinking i'm going to use these it's also a tap no it's not a tap it's a reinforcer but my thought is okay oh i need my um thingy <laughs> i don't know what's the name um the punch the corner chomper no the corner chomper the uh, the punch thing then i can put this here and slide it out or 
should I take some taps? Because otherwise this goes too far. Okay. Sorry guys. Looking one of my boxes again. <laughs> I'm trying to read the comments. <laughs> uh, pool tabs, well, you can use anything like this, tabs. Mm, but it needs to be a little bit sturdy because when you pull it out, well, um, you don't want it to, uh, to tear. Oh, this one is nice. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. No, this one doesn't fit over there. We've got these. I didn't cut them off. Um, oh, that's a good one. Now I hope there's another one in here. <laughs> it probably isn't, but you never know. I'm going to give it a quick look to see if I've got one more, and otherwise I will do that later. Oh, bummer. Bummer, bummer, bummer. There are too many in here. <laughs> yes, no, it's not. <laughs> it's not. I always cut a lot of um, those elements when there's a new release and then I start playing with all those little things and put them in a big box. And that's why there are so many in here now, <laughs> but never the right one. No. One more quick look on the other side. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, got it. Uh, I think these are really nice. Oh, but then I need one more here too. Okay, I'm going to distress those. Where is my... And I know we have those little stamps saying pull here or something like that. Would they fit? I already took some other stamps, but I think I forgot hmm, to look for those. Okay, I will attach this first and then we'll see uh, if I can stamp on it later. Okay, I'm going to get some glue. David, are you sick? David, feel better? Ah, crocodile, yes. Oh, you were still? Uh, you were ill, David? Are you still ill? I hope you're not, but I thought you were awesome. Oh, no, awesome, no. Awfully quiet the last couple of weeks. And I was thinking, oh, he is so busy with work. But if you are sick, that's not funny at all. So I hope you get well soon. Okay, that's one. Now, the other one, let me see. If I, it's going to be here. What shall I do? Yes, I'm going to place that one a little bit lower. Oh. By the way, if you start hearing some drilling noises, drilling and breaking and things like that, uh, our neighbors, <laughs> um, the house has been sold next to us and they are um, well, doing a lot of demolition and uh, building it up again. So sometimes there's a lot of noise going on. So I hope he doesn't start drilling uh, for the next uh, 45 minutes or so. Okay, I think it's going to come together really well already. Um, well, I won't bother you with um, looking for another of those tabs in my box with goodies because otherwise it takes too long. But I think I'm going to give it a try and see if I can uh, attach it to the page. Okay, I need a punch. This is one. Which size has this one got? I have no idea. It doesn't say. It should be on there somewhere, but it's a small one. It's not the 0.5 um, centimeters we normally have. Uh, it's not the same size as the whole reinforcers, so I'm going to take a smaller one and I'm going to put that one here. Is it better to cut them all together, punch them all together? But 
how do I know if I am... Hmm. It might be a good idea to do it this way, don't you think? Okay, I'm going to give it a cry. Try, <laughs> not a cry. Keep your fingers crossed. It's a little bit thick. Mm, not going to be close to the edges, too close. It's no, it works. I did it. I did it. <laughs> yes. Okay, now I need one of those breads. I've got some bigger ones, some smaller ones. I think I'm going to take one of the larger ones. I think these are Tim Holtz. Um, should it be okay like this? Yeah, I think so. Let me give it a try. See if they all fit. <laughs> oh, this is the other side of my pa uh, page, yes. Oh, it's going to be a little bit too big on the other side. I didn't think of that. I, oh, I'm going to fold it a little bit. Uh, you see, like this, in a corner. And would it work? Did you think? Yay! Let me see. Do you see? Oh, I love it when a plan comes together. And you see, because I uh, put this one in um, on its side, when you take it out, you can read what's on it. Uh, there's nothing on it yet, but I'm going to write something later on. Um, oh my, the comments. Okay, sorry. Um, I can't keep up with the comments, guys. I'm sorry for that. Okay, so now my all my pictures are hidden uh, in a pocket. So um, you can also do this or something like this uh, when you want to journal about something and you don't want anyone to see it or uh, make it a little bit a more private spot. You can also do something like this, but uh, for me now, this is just for fun. Uh, okay, I'm going to put this one back in. These I made last week with uh, um, the live on my YouTube channel. And a beautiful card I got from... Um, oh, here my, my, <laughs> my brain <laughs> again. Uh, Ingrid, sorry Ingrid. <laughs> she is uh, awesome in uh, hand lettering. So this is a little bit um, yeah, boring, still a little bit boiling. So my idea was over here to use something which Marie Claire does a lot, just do some stamping. Now I took one of the older sets, it's uh, stamp setter 144 and it's about cooking. And I was thinking, okay, I'm going to use the words ingredients, directions and kiss the cook or something like that sandwiches there was nothing about pancakes so i'm going to take the more uh, general ones uh, and i am going to give it a try put this one aside and i was thinking okay i'm thinking a lot <laughs> i think i say this quite often sorry uh, i don't want to change um, the clear blocks and the stems over and over so i took three of those clear blocks and i am going to um, apply some of the stems. Which one? Directions, ingredients. Okay, I'm going for ingredients. And then I am taking Kiss the Cook because these little two, these two little girls will cooking. <laughs> one of them burnt, their, burnt, burnt her fingers on the, on the pan. So then she didn't like it anymore. <laughs> okay, so I've got ingredients, kiss the cook, directions, sizes and dips. Yeah, I'm going to use directions. And hopefully I can do this just as uh, beautiful as Marie Claire always does. And I already feel this is not even, you know, because there's something on, on the other side. I'm going to take this out because I want to do some stamping and it still has some different heights. So I hope I will be doing fine. I'm just putting something underneath. It's just a piece of foam. It's very old and I have no idea where it comes from, but that's what I usually uh, use when I want to do some stamping. Uh, I am going to directions. Yeah. Directions and then kiss the cook. Ink, I need some black ink. Okay. Oh, thanks so much, Jenny. 
I always think I'm um, talking too fast. But if you say it's relaxing, I'm good. <laughs> okay. No, that's the wrong one. Let's just kiss the cook. Directions. And it's not straight on my clear block. So I need to adjust it a little bit. Okay. Giving it a try. I hope you don't see the top of my head, but well, it's just a stamp, you know. <laughs> uh, it's a little bit off center, but it's handwork, handmade. Let me see this one. Should I do it the same? Kiss the cook, kiss the. <laughs> I, I think I'm going to use only these two words ingredients. Directions. Well, none of them exactly fit. So, uh, directions, ingredients, directions. It doesn't really matter. Directions. Kiss the cook. Kiss the cook. I think I'm going to do kiss the cook three times. That sounds a little bit funny, don't you think? Directions. Kiss the cook. Kiss the cook. Kiss the cook. Okay. This is another one, and I don't think the third time will fit but you will get the idea kiss the co <laughs> i like it okay putting these aside too i will clean this up later Oops. <laughs> craft some yeah I think I did quite nice, Marie Claire, don't you think? It's a little bit wonky, but I don't mind. But I like this, you know? Hmm. So, on the other side in my journal is another page, and that page has some reds. And I think I mentioned that before. Let me see. Yeah, it's going to be here. Like this. And I'm not sure yet about this part being here, but I can take it out if I want. So um, the pictures are going to be on. And because uh, I think this is a little bit boring this way, I did uh, pre-cut some uh, letters, making the use uh, the word pancakes. So I already prepared most of them because otherwise it takes a little bit too long uh, for you to watch me uh, yeah, seeing doing this. Watch me seeing doing this. Okay, that's not proper English, I think, but um, I'm going to take those out. So it's going to be something like this. Let me see. Mm. I hope everything <laughs> finds its way found its way pancakes and into this pocket and I didn't lose anything pancakes oh yeah okay you see the last three letters I have to um, glue together because I first only cut the the letters out of red uh, cardstock design cardstock design paper but I thought that was a little bit um, yeah um, flat or boring too so I added uh, the same letter uh, again um, in black. So this is just a very thin piece of black paper and I cut out the same letter. So I need to um, glue those together. So you can see how I am going to do this. Do this. I'm just applying them a little bit off center. So it gives you a, a little bit an idea of uh, a shadow. So uh, you can see the difference here. I will show it to you. Cakes. <laughs> so, just to give you an idea what a difference it makes when you are um, adding a black uh, solid piece uh, underneath the red letters. I hope this makes sense and that you can see it. <laughs> Maple syrup, yes! <laughs> so, uh, I need to do those three letters. I'm sorry you have to watch me see me doing this okay i'm going to take a little 
piece of white paper so I can see what I'm doing because of the black uh, mat, mat, mat <laughs> on the table. Okay, okay. I prepared those with double-sided adhesive at the back, so it's easy for me to glue them together. Hopefully it works when you're all watching. <laughs> uh, let me see. So a little bit of center to the left and to the bottom side. So there's this letter E. And while I'm doing this, I now see that I didn't put the double-sided adhesive at the back of the black letter, so um, I'm going to have those glue those down with a little bit of glue, but that's not such a problem. Pancakes, the letter S, the last one. <laughs> okay. Hopefully this one works out too. Yes, here we go. Oh, almost. Look at this. Okay, now I need to attach them, of course. And I think I'm going to look for the stamps to add something over here because that's a little bit boring this way too. I need to glue down on the other side. Um, yes, I'm going to leave it a little bit on this side. So I'm going to line it up uh, to the left side of this page, or it depends on how you see it. You can also see, say it's the top side, the, the uh, <laughs> on the top. Only a few more letters to go, guys. <laughs> yes, it's a little bit confusing um, because of the different time we are doing the live today. But if you missed it again, you can rewatch it later on uh, on our Facebook page, and I'm also going to put it on my um, YouTube channel. So. It's going to be saved on two different um, social media things, thingies, pancakes. Yeah, I'm talking too much, but I need to make sure I'm going. I'm gluing down the letters in the correct order. Yes, it's nice with the black shadow, don't you think? Oh, and I added some extra red on those letters because it was from one of the previous, um, let me see if I can find a little piece of paper. Mm. Oh, yeah. Here's some leftover. I cut the letters from this paper. It's from, I think, one of the first books we did. Uh, it has some red, but it wasn't red enough, so I added a fired brick on top of it, just to give it, make it a little bit... Um, pop out a little bit more. Okay, I think there's a little bit too much glue on this one. What time is it? Let me see. 15 minutes, okay. We're doing good. I'm not sure if I'm able to finish it completely, but it's coming quite good. Uh, now it's coming <laughs> good together. Well, <laughs> oh, it works out fine so far. Okay. Pancakes. And I wanted my plan is to add a little bit more red over here. So, and I'm afraid that takes a little bit more time, but I'm going to give it a try and see if I can make it in uh, 
10, 15 minutes. Okay. This is still a little bit uh, yeah, plain, but because of this, and maybe I can leave it out like this um, anyway, because I'm not sure if I should apply something here. I'm first going to do something here with stamps. So, what was I thinking for this? Yes, okay. Oops. <laughs> I've got a little bag over here with leftover pieces and it doesn't really care, care matter which one I am going to take. Uh, no, it doesn't need to be really thick. The only thing is that I want to make sure it's long enough. So. I want to make a strip over here with stamps, which so it looks a little bit similar to this side. I'm going to take this one. Okay, then I have a box with stamps somewhere. <laughs> I had it just before we started this. Yeah, okay, here we go. Here it is. Putting this one to the sides. So I'm going to apply some stamps from top to bottom. And then I'm going to die cut uh, the same page again and I'm trimming off the edge. So I have the reinforcers only. Oh, there's a red one on top. <laughs> so I'm taking out everything which has a little bit red, reddish in it. Oh, English flag. Okay, I know it's red. This is red. This is not red, red, but. It all comes together, as you can see. This is too orange. Mm, I hope there's some, oh, red flowers. Well, it's a little bit pink, but I think, no, it's too pink. It's too pink. This one is more red. And I see something red over here. Oh, how cool is this one? Post books. But I am afraid. Hmm. A cool one and how long is the page it should be something like just adding one or more extra let me see if i see something really special quickly with a little bit more red oh red i like amsterdam more than rotterdam sorry guys <laughs> No, I don't like that one. Oh, this one is good too. US Airmail. I like that one too. Okay. Now I'm going to glue them down randomly. So don't think about it too much. Just um, yeah, glue them down. But what I always think about is that as you see now, the, these are now stacked on top of each other. So you see one, two, three, four, five. They're all in the same layering effect so it's better that's what i'm thinking change them a little bit around one goes up one goes underneath so it's a little bit more um yeah playful or, or, and i like this one so <laughs> that's a good red one so i'm just trying to mix and match and now you see automatically you will put them in the same um how do you say that? What's in duck pannen in het Engels? Geen idee. Those things you put on your roof. <laughs> and automatically they will in that order again. And I hate it. I don't want that. So I'm going to put one down, this one on top of it, each other again. So. Okay, no, this one needs to go over here. Because this has a little bit blue over there, and then I want a little bit blue there too. Okay, now we need to try and glue them down. Unfortunately, those don't stick anymore when you wet them. So, shingles, yes. <laughs> shingles, yes. And I don't want them to look like shingles. So, this one goes down. Oh, and this one goes down. Mm. 
Yeah, that's okay. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. And then we do the shingle thing again, Esther. <laughs> Trying to this a little bit higher. And then this one and this one here. And I'm also trying to move then the one to the left, one to the right. So they are not in a straight line too. This is a fun one, a round one. Oh, it's from New Zealand, one dollar New Zealand. I think it's quite special to have a round stamp. Not sure if we ever have those in Holland. Round stamps. There probably are, but I haven't seen them. The painting is very light. Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 what I mean, Karen. It's more interesting doing it this way. Now it needs to go up a little bit higher because otherwise I won't cover it up. Putting the flower one there. Mm. Okay, let's try to put this one. Then the big one. Yeah, why not? And then, no, this one first. Just playing around. And yeah, just put them on top of each other the way you like it most. Uh, should I take this one? Oh, I will put this one aside because I think this is long enough. Yep, this will work. So I'm going to glue down a few more. And then this one over here. And if necessary, I can glue them down a little bit better, but I think I'm good because uh, I'm going to um, die cut it in a minute and then it will be uh, okay, I think, I hope. <laughs> Okay, glue and a pin to close it. And then I'm trying to see if I can see some of your, um, yeah, the round stamp, Belinda. It's cool, isn't it? <laughs> yes, else I'm wonky. <laughs> okay, uh, I need a die. Where is it? Over here. And I am just going to give it a try. Now, the thing is, I am going to use it on this side of the page. Well, actually, it doesn't matter now. Because, yeah, okay, let me do it the correct way. I only want to use this part, you know, with the holes. So you only see a little bit uh, of those stamps in a minute. And maybe if there's some leftovers, I can use it somewhere else. But I'm going to give it a try this way. And I think I'm going to glue it down with a little bit of tape just to make sure, a little bit here. Okay, let's see if this is going to work. No. Trying to read your comments. The cooking stamp set, no, I don't think the same one is going to be, uh, going to come back again. If we are doing one, it will be a new one. Okay, this is fresh. You see, you can throw this away. And now over here, you've got a part with the holes in it. I hope you can see it. I will keep it a little bit closer to the camera. So you see, the holes are exactly in the same um, position as you want them to be. And now I can trim it off and glue it down like this. Um, it looks pretty cool already, but I want it to be a straight line. Um, you can make it as wide as you want. Normally I would do it a really small one, just like a border, but I think it's a little bit of waste of those stamps, you know. 
Well, I think I'm going to trim it down. Who cares? It's only a few stamps. Yeah? Okay. Like this. And my working space is getting smaller and smaller. Let me see. Here are the reinforcer, the holes, the rings. They are here. So I think I need a centimeter and a half, which is, I don't care, three quarter of an inch or something. No. Yeah. Maybe less. I'm not so good in converting them by head. So let me see. This is going to be here. I'm going to put it a little bit further to make it a little bit wider. Make sure it's straight and then hopefully it turns out okay so this is what i wanted and i am going to glue this one here oh i like it <laughs> i hope you like it too i uh, i don't think it needs any distress ink do you think hmm. just give it a little bit always looks a li little bit nicer when you do it. Oh. Yeah, sorry guys, if you're too late, too late please, uh, you can watch this uh, Facebook Live again if you want on the Elizabeth Craft Designs um, Facebook page or tomorrow I will also place it on my YouTube channel. So no worries. <laughs> Yeah, I think this looks pretty cool. I need some glue. <laughs> I'm not sure if yeah, I, I can put a little bit of glue on this side too. And then here we go. I think it looks perfect this way. Okay, here we go. One interactive, interactive ish <laughs> um, page with some slides, or how do you want to call them? Uh, I need to do some more stamping, but it's almost time. Yes, I need to look for those other stamps, so I'm not sure where I put them. So I'm, they're not by hand, so I can't take them really quickly now. So, but I think you will get the idea of how to make this with just a simple bread in a corner and some um, pieces of cardstock which you slide on the uh, pocket. This is something I've got left. Not sure if I'm going to use it uh, here. I don't think so. Um, I should. Oh, I can do it here actually. Should I do that? Is it too much when I put it in here? What do you think? I think it's possible, don't you think? Hmm. I'm not sure if this one, if this will stay working. Yeah, it will keep on working. Why not? Shall I put it here? What do you think? <laughs> uh, thanks so much, Waldo, Suzanne, <laughs> and Joe. I'm waiting for your comments about. Um, oh, thank you, Elke. Yes. You want me to put it down here? Yes, do it. Okay. It's a waste of throwing it away, you know. I need to trim it down a little bit. Okay, just a little bit on the side here. And then I'm going to ink it on this side too. Okay, we all agree on <laughs> adding it to the other side. <laughs> no, that's quick. That's not really difficult to do. <laughs> Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> we all think alike. Great minds think alike. Yeah, I think I, it looks pretty cool. Okay. No more thinking about it. Just glue it down. Make sure it's going to be underneath those other. And it's just a little bit more detail on this side of the page. So you see now it all comes together. Some stamps over here, here and on this side. I am 
thinking I should take away this one. I'm not sure because I've got one of those pictures left. Yeah, I'm going to do something with this one over here. But I will finish that later, tomorrow, I think. And I will post pictures on, uh, on Facebook in our groups. Okay, well, I hope you liked it. And uh, now the technical part uh, comes here again for me to see how to close this. <laughs> That's always exciting because um, I am on Facebook, I am in another computer program and I think I've found it. So I'm going to say goodbye to you now. Um, hopefully you liked it. I hope to see you soon. I will be back on my YouTube channel next Tuesday and a week later I will be back uh, here on the Elizabeth Craft Designs Facebook page on Monday evening, Monday afternoon. Uh, I hope to see you soon, guys. Take care and have a nice rest of the day or evening, wherever you are. Okay, bye-bye.